Hi guys, welcome back for part two of solving equations review. Today we're just going to step up the level of difficulty just a tiny bit. And the reason these are a little bit more difficult today is if you'll notice, there are variables on both sides of the equal sign. So when there's variables on both sides of the equal sign, you move them from side to side a little bit differently. So first we're going to simplify each side of the equal sign completely. So distribute and combine like terms. So on the left side, distribute that 7 to both terms and you'll get 14v minus 28. Bring down the equal sign in the middle and there's nothing on the right side to simplify. And this is the big difference between what we're doing today and what we did yesterday. There's a v on both sides of that equal sign. So to combine like terms when they're on opposite sides like that, you have to do the opposite. If they're on opposite sides of the equal sign, do the opposite. So to get the 3v with the 14v, I'm going to subtract 3v on both sides. And I usually just subtract the smaller number. You could have also subtracted 14v. It doesn't really matter which thing you do. I just subtract the smaller number so that I get a positive answer, but no big deal, most of the time anyway. All right, so now I have 14v minus 3v, which is 11v bring down my negative 28, bring down my equals, and bring down my negative 6. Get the 11v by itself, add 28 to both sides, and I have 11v equals 22, divide by 11, divide by 11, and v equals 2, do -si do And that's pretty much it. If you want, you can try the next example on your own and then check it, or just sit back and relax and watch me doing it. I don't mind either way. Okay, so this one, it's still distributing, but if you remember, if there's a negative in front of parentheses like that, then it's the same as distributing a negative 1. Okay, so I'm going to bring down the negative 8m. I'm going to distribute a negative 1 to each of these, which is just the same as adding or changing the signs. So negative 1 times a negative m will now make this a big fat plus m. Negative 1 times a positive 4 will make that a negative 4. Okay, bring down the equals and bring down the right side. Combine like terms. Well, on the left side we have like terms right there. So negative 8 plus 1 is a negative 7m. And this brings us to the new part of today's lesson. If you have variables on opposite sides of the equal sign, then you do the opposite. To get those m terms together, I have to do the opposite. Either add 2m to both sides or add 7m to both sides. Personally, I'm going to add the 7m because I prefer to move the smaller number so I get a positive answer, but it doesn't really matter. Bring down my negative 4. Bring down my equals. Negative 2 plus 7 is 5m. And bring down the plus 11. Okay, focus on the variable, get that 5m by itself, so subtract 11 on both sides. And now I have 5m equals, signs are the same, so you add negative 15, divide by negative, or sorry, divide by 5, divide by 5, and final answer, m equals negative 3. Okay, so that's it, just a quick review, warming you up nice and slow this week. Um, your assignment is a short worksheet, just like those problems that you did. Good luck!